brick is um, very silent and elegant, but not uh, simple-minded. So it's reduced to its material and um, its substance and not to its color or darkness. It's a light, uh, fresh, modern, friendly uh, atmosphere designed by the architects using brick. The church was partially demolished in 1936 because of the effects of the Spanish Civil War. But Catalonia has a strong tradition in the field of ceramical brick solutions. So our contribution is just some sort of continuity of that tradition. Brick is a very common, simple element in one hand, but in the other hand, we aim to use in a very uncommon situation. Today, the church is in a, a multi-purpose hall. So it is a free open plan space that serves uh, for many, many activities, for concerts or weddings or events. When we have a look at the interior, we realize that there's some sort of contrast between the new elements and the ancient part of the building. So the dialogue between contemporary uh, attitude and uh, the restoration of and the, re the recovering of the, of the ancient building was very present. We have a look to the solutions. We like to say that we try to establish some sort of a soft contrast. That's what we decided to paint everything in white in order to not only introduce light and clarity, to uh, incorporate a balanced situation between, between what is new and what is old, what is past and what is present. We decided to introduce a patio in the center of the church, in the lateral nave. It is a very uncommon element of the church, but it is one of the most powerful uh, solutions in order to introduce clarity and brightness and, and, and light in the church. We wanted to recreate a sacred atmosphere that aims to establish what it was in the past. So some of the solutions in terms of space or in terms of materials have been focused in order to preserve that atmosphere, that uh, in some sense mystical atmosphere. So the illumination, that suspended uh, illumination uh, aims to work in that line. I think that the project could have a small influence in the uh, concept of restoration, in the concept of rehabilitation, in the concept of the recuperation of the ancient building. I think that we have to understand that this project represents a contemporary attitude in the way that we work with the past.